What's up guys, welcome back to the Pokemon Omicron Nuzlocke. Last episode, we began going north to take on Team Olympus. Today we're going to be continuing onwards. I went back and I uh, healed everyone up and bought a few repels. Uh, we got into one battle, so if you're wondering why Pom Pom may be level 19 now, that is why. We had uh, a battle on the way back. So, that's the team right now. Uh, everyone's actually still pretty decent in levels, so we're going to keep going. Just take on a couple of trainers. Hopefully, they're not scary. That slacking's slightly scary, but I don't think it can hit us. So we're gonna will o wisp because I don't think I, I I don't think it can do anything to us. So we're gonna confuse it too. It can probably only use yawn because I don't know. I think I don't think it gets any other good. I it, I don't know if it gets faint attack or not or like. Bite? I don't think he gets bite. But I think he may get some kind of dark type move. But it probably doesn't have it, so. If we could wake up. And he withdraws into him and. That's not any better. I mean. I just will a wisp it. Helping hand. What? This guy's not smart. Unfortunately, we still can't really hit this one, so. And yeah, we're gonna we're gonna switch out. I don't want this. Uh, PC God can just brick break everything to death. So let's do that. Can you? Can this button stuff not happen? If we accidentally lose an encounter because my thing glitches, like I'm gonna lose it. A cranium dose. We can still brick break it. This entire team gets bodied by a. Uh, PC God, so. There we go. Just eat everything alive. This slacking can do literally nothing because it's burned, so. Unless it has facade, which would be horrifying. It's only got on course, nope. That's hilarious. Okay. There we go, lovely. Oh. Those levels up. PC God's actually like an animal, so. But I do want to. I want to try to get illumination uh, closer in levels. And it's just, uh, of course it's something that we can't hit. Being in the rain does not help though. So I'm gonna go into JJ, our starter, who's actually kind of low leveled compared to the others. But it's just a brick break. Yeah, look at that damage. There we go. Lovely. I did not see what's coming out. I think this thing has Dragon Rage, so... Stash at our big red button. It's got Metal Claw, so... That's good to know. It's also part steel, so... This Powder Snow is not going to really do much. And... Never mind, we get the Freeze! Stash at has been so lucky with the Freeze. We've gotten so many... Uh... Freezes. Let's try it, and of course. Okay. Um, uh, we're gonna Powder Snow again. Oh my! And it gets the boost. Can we freeze again? No? Okay. Um... We can- we can go into PC God. Because we can eat a Metal Claw. Yeah, we eat that. And then we can just Brick Break. <laughs> that Ancient Power is scary, though. Will a Mock Punch kill? Oh, thank god. Okay. I would have been a little depressed. I would have been very depressed, actually. So. Counter? No. We're not gonna do that. Shup it? Um. I don't want to go into Illumination. Uh. Uh. You have some kind of flying type move, right? You got Wing Attack. Yeah, we're good. Let's go into Freedom. Let's go, boys. Let's wing attack. Oh hell yeah. Freedom's so broken. Okay. We need more healing items. We are all out of healing items and PC God's almost dead, so. I don't think we fight um I don't think we fight uh the team Olympus that are up here though. So 
A snubble, okay. It's only level 9? What the hell? Uh, it's a nightshade. And it's a normal type. Is snubble usually normal fairy? I don't remember. I've ne I, I've used Gramble like once since Gen 6 came out. I guess we'll just go into Pom Pom. Or maybe it's only a normal type in this game. I don't know. It was fa it got turned into a fairy type as far as I can... Yeah. I don't know. I'm not going to question it. I don't know, man. Let's keep going. Oh, cool. Berries. Give me the berries. Give me these berries. Lovely. Alright. Okay. We have so many battles up this entire route. I'm gonna put freedom up front. Because freedom can kind of body everything that's not like a rock or electric type. A vile plume. Perfect. I'm gonna wing attack you. Oh, hell yeah. Alright. Let's just get ready to body everyone. I don't know what's coming out. Nidoran? Okay. Wing attack. And it lived. Okay. One more. No poison point. Lovely. A Growlithe. Okay. This guy's got quite the team. And it lived on 1 HP. Okay. Dead. Cool. Freedom is kind of like... Our mon that bodies literally everything and everyone, no matter what happens. But we're gonna heal you up a little. We're gonna heal you up a little. Okay. There we go. Now, like, literally, this entire thing is betting off of the fact that we don't fight uh, Team Olympus up here. So, hopefully, we don't fight Team Olympus up here. Uh, let's go into JJ. Rock slide, eat that, and we can brick break. Yep, bodied. Metacham, um, it's a psychic type, so I don't really like that. Uh, I'm gonna go into freedom. A wing attack should be more than enough to kill. I hope. I mean, it's stab super effective, and it's got to take. Never mind. If it double detects, I'm gonna lose it. Okay. Mind Raider, so what does it got? Jump <laughs> high jump kick? Nope. You did. We get a bunch of experience and I love it. Frost last? Okay. PC God can body this thing. As long as it doesn't destiny bond us. Uh let's go for that. Alright. No, we're good. We're good. There we go. Thank you, PC God, for being a winner. Alright. No, no. Zeus, this has gone on long enough. I know why Team Olympus has taken over the Pokemon. What? And wait, I don't know who's talking. We'll never succeed. You don't have the time caller, there will be... Okay. Is that so? I know someone who might disagree with you. Isn't that right? Nick. Oh, hi. Nick, did you hear what he just said? He's laughing, right? If they truly had the time color, then the world as we know it could be doomed. Are they really telling the truth? Please, Nick, they can't be. No, no, no. It can't be. Believe it, Arya. It is a shame you never chose to join us all those years ago. You should have had a taste of this. You could have had a taste of this. Ha <laughs> ha! Feast your eyes on the almighty shaman, the legendary Pokemon. It... It can't be. No. I will not stand to see another brave Pokemon enslaved. I will fight against the corruption of stronger Pokemon as well. Wahaha! <laughs> I won't fight you today. Shaman, clear us a path. We've done it. We're done evacuating Nyasa Town. Let's go to the Pokeharjan Collider. See you later. This is not good. They found one of the most powerful artifacts known to mankind, and they've already used it to summon a rare and powerful Pokemon. We can still beat them, right? I don't know. I honestly don't know. Nick, have you ever met the legend researcher? He lives in Superior Town, and he researches legendary Pokemon. 
I need you to go see him. He has a book explaining the origins of the universe. Nick, you need to know how big a threat this is. That book explains everything. We'll wait for your return. Okay. Oh, okay. Nick made the long trek back to Superior Town. Oh, thank God. Okay, I forgot about this. Okay. Hey there, sorry about the mess. I haven't been cleaning in the lab lately. I've been out on the field work, like the unknown mission you helped with, remember? Oh, this guy. I don't know if this is the same. Well, never mind. We'll just go with it. Well, I may have gotten a bit distracted. I'm studying this statue. I think it may be a legendary Pokemon. You can help if you want. I've been collecting scriptures and prophecies about legendary Pokemon. My research is in the book on the table if you want to check it out. Maybe you'll find a legendary Pokemon. It's the book the professor was talking about. Read what it says. In the ancient void, there was nothing. Then there was an egg. A golden egg. A powerful egg. Inside this egg, there was beast known as Arceus. Arceus, the original Pokemon. Arceus created the world as we know it. Time, space, and antimatter, and created awe-inspiring beasts to guard them. Arceus created life to inhabit the world, and then sealed himself away in his own dimension. Before he did this, however, he created a Pokemon too. The book is too burnt to keep reading. Oh, Nick, sorry about the mess. Oh, the professor's staying here? That must mean... Team Olympus found the Pokemon, or the time color, right? This isn't good. We need to talk. How do I put this? Remember that unknown you saw in the cave? It was pretty powerful, right? Imagine that kind of power times a couple billion, and you have the power of a legendary Pokemon. See, the time color allows its user to splice the fabric of time and bring f something from the past to the present. Effectively, it's called it calls a Pokemon from another time. If Team Olympus has that, then they could they could catch every legendary Pokemon ever. And if they if they remember how I told you to go visit Wilson in Vianga City. Wilson is one of the lead scientists at the Pokemon Hardin Collier. Collier, man, yeah, I don't know. It's just, they can summon a really powerful Pokemon that the Pokemon Hardin Collider. That's, I don't, I, never mind. If they'd use the Time Collar. You read the myth of Arceus, right? Well, it says that Arceus created the universe and then fell into a deep sleep. But last year I asked myself, if Arceus created the world, who maintains it? Suddenly everything began to click into place. Those strange writings nobody could understand, those were hieroglyphs. Those weird hieroglyphs? From what I can gather, Arceus created a Pokemon with the power to match its own, to watch over the universe in this, his absence. The scriptures say this Pokemon can travel through time, bend dimensions, and more. Maybe I'm exaggerating, but can you imagine if a po such a Pokemon fell into Team Olympus's hand? You better go. Go find the, uh, the professor and tell him what I told you. Alright, so they've made a long trek back to Route 307. Alright, so... We're back at Route 307, but we are going to have to end the episode here, guys. So next episode, we will go find the professor. So if you guys enjoyed, make sure you smash that like button. If you want to see more, make sure you subscribe and get deposited right in that PC party. Share it with your friends, follow me on Twitter at PC Bloodmaster. Join the Discord, link is down below. If you guys enjoyed, leave a like, comment, and subscribe. I'm PC Bloodmaster, and I will see you guys next time.